Hey everybody, today in this video we'll be cooking soy sauce chicken thighs in an Instapot 11 quart pressure cooker. Let's begin. We have here some ginger. There we go. Okay, we have four slices of ginger. We're gonna put that to the side. We have here three cups of soy sauce. We're gonna add two tablespoons of minced garlic. One, two. We're gonna add two tablespoons of pure sesame seed oil. That's one. And two. We're gonna add one sour anise. Look something like this. So that's one. We're gonna add one teaspoon of Chinese five spice powder. One teaspoon of ground cinnamon. One teaspoon of ground cinnamon. And also one teaspoon of ground white pepper. There we go, that's one teaspoon. And now stir everything all together. Okay, the last thing we're gonna add is some brown sugar. We're gonna add one cup. Let's see here. Shake it up. That's one cup of brown sugar. And we're just gonna add it in the soy sauce. Then stir. We're also gonna add some chicken broth. We're gonna need two cups. So let's pour two cups. Okay, that's two cups of uh, chicken broth. We're gonna put that to the side. We have here a whole tray of chicken thighs. It's around eight pieces. And uh, the first thing what we're gonna do is uh, saute them first. So we're just gonna push the saute button. And uh, we're just gonna let it heat up first. Okay, we have the uh, pressure cooker on saute. And now we're gonna add some uh, oil into the 11 quart pressure cooker. Go. Spread the oil around. Go. Now we're gonna add the eight pieces of chicken thigh. We're gonna set the chicken in. Okay, it's around two minutes. We're gonna flip it over. Okay, it's been two minutes on both sides. We're gonna use a spatula, scrape it under, just to make sure it doesn't stick, and we're gonna pull them all out. Here we go. Okay, we have all the chicken out. Now we're just gonna add some water to clean the uh, the pot. You want to use a wooden spatula and we're just gonna scrape the bottom to remove any of the uh, food particles from sticking onto the pot. The reason why you want to do this is because you don't want to get a burn error uh, from your Instapot. Okay, we want to turn off the Instapot right now. Then I'm gonna remove the, uh, the water. Okay, we're gonna put it back in and now we're gonna add the sauce. Here we go. Now we're gonna add the chicken back in. 
There you go. Okay, we have the eight piece uh, chicken thigh in the uh, pot. And now we're gonna add two cups of chicken broth. There you go, looking good. We're gonna add the four pieces of uh, sliced ginger. Okay, this is what it looks like before we close it up. One is somewhat submerged. There we go, it's in the locking position. It's fully sealed. And uh, we're gonna push on pressure cook. And we're going for 14 minutes on high. Okay, the pressure cooker has finally heated up and uh, the timer has finally started for 14 minutes. And we'll be back. Okay, it's been 14 minutes total. And now we're gonna release the uh, steam. Just push on this button to release. Okay, the red pin has dropped back down. That tells me that it's safe to open up the uh, pressure cooker. Ooh, really hot. Put this over here. Oh boy, it smells really good. Let's take them out. Okay, we have one out. Let's put it right here. Okay, it's a hundred. It's over 170 degrees. Safe to eat. We want the internal temperature of the chicken to be around 165 and it's well, it's well above that. Okay, let's take the rest out. Oh boy, it smells good. You guys should give this a try. The aroma is just perfect. Okay, we're just gonna put a little bit of green onions on top. Okay, this is what we have today. Soy sauce chicken thighs made in the pressure cooker. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give this video a like and subscribe for more future recipes. Oh boy, let's give one a try. Oh yeah, it's really tender. Oh. Mm. It's really good. You should, give, you should give this recipe a try. It's fantastic. Thanks for watching guys. Here, have a bite. And thanks for watching.